Hi everyone again, this is Sabi Wolf doing another unboxing video and before I started on this one I wanted to give a quick shout out because um, I know her wolf video went a little bit viral but I wanted to let everybody know that my beautiful my beautiful face, my beautiful paws, and my full suit and everything, yes I do have a full suit, it's too hot to wear it right now, was made by Ghost or uh, Yellow Freak with the E being a three and I just wanted to give a shout out to her because I love Sabi. I think she's fantastic. She's so well made. She was made perfectly compared to the picture that she made for me. So I just wanted to give a quick shout out to her and a big thank you for um, what she made for me. And I love her. So um, this is a couple of gets that I've gotten. Uh, most of them are from eBay. I, I did get one order from Japan in this box and one order that I got a while ago, but I had never shown it off and I saw it sitting downstairs on my gaming shelf and I'm like, huh, I don't know why I ever showed that off or why I didn't put it in my collection room because this is where it belongs. So let's get started. Let's start off with the first thing that came from Japan. Now this came from, it's called Pokevault.com and the guy who runs it, his name is Brian. I think he's very nice. Uh, I think his stuff is fairly overpriced, but every so often he will send out a, a code to get some money off and uh, I just found some things that are relatively cheap that I didn't have yet and it was cheaper to buy from him and import from him than it was currently buying and importing from uh, Marikari or Yahoo Japan auctions just because um, you know the middleman services charge like five dollars an item and that would have made it more expensive plus they're only shipping via DHL and that's really expensive so let's get into it so here I have uh, it's a hard DSi cover that features the legendary beast and, uh, you know, Lugia and ho -Oh, and it's for DSi. The thing is, like, this kind of pushes in. So I, I thought this was, like, a hard plastic piece. It looks like it is, but, I don't know, it's kind of, like, dented in. I'm a little sad about that, but... So there's that. I just, you know, something random that I didn't have yet, so I'll set that off. Uh, another thing that I was surprised I didn't have, I could have sworn I had this, but I guess not but it's a keychain from the Zoroark movie. Um, I'm surprised it only features Entei and Raikou and not Suicune, because Suicune's one of the more popular ones, and <laughs> Entei kind of isn't, but I bought this because it's cheap, and you know, I was just getting a bunch of things, and I was like, well, I should make the $25 worth the shipping. So I got that. Then another little thing I got were some cheap stickers and uh, a stamp featuring Entei. It's a little old school there. I think my paws are kind of in the way, but tiny little Entei there, figured I'd get that. This I've been kind of eyeing up for a while. It's not quite what I expected. There's actually like holes kind of punched out. These actually, you couldn't use these to actually send mail, but it was just like a little fan thing that they, they did. So I decided to get Entei's. I think there's another stamp set with him being featured that I'd like to find someday. And then I got the, my 151 sticker. Avente, my 251, because this was with Johto. So yeah, got that. I actually have the sticker, but it's by itself. Let's see if I can, I guess. Um, and it was just cut out, the Trozy sticker. I think the Trozy is really cute. So I just got the full set because I, it was, uh, you know, on sale, on sale. And then this, I've just, ugh, come on. <laughs> This I've been avoiding getting just because I felt like it was kind of overpriced, you know, Americari and Y Japan, it's it's a lot cheaper, but with the, you know, buy -e fees and shipping right now, it was actually cheaper to get it from him, so I did. I think it's really pretty. I think it's a lot nicer than I expected. It's really nice and thick. I wasn't really expecting that. So yeah, that's everything from Brian. So um, I'm gonna butcher your name. I'm sorry, I asked how to say your name yesterday, and I just like... It's here, how, era, 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 she, chu, era, oh my gosh, I'm so sorry, <laughs> someone on the Discord, I'm so sorry, I, like, I'm so bad with names, please don't hate me, but like, sh they were so sweet, we've, we've done a trade, uh, I traded some Dialga stuff for um, these polka dolls, and they included some extra things, and I think they said it was bootleg. I, I'm pretty sure that's what they said. And I think he's so cute. He's so fat and derpy looking and he's got a suction cup and oh my gosh, I want to suction him and put him up in my car so everybody can see him. But yeah, here's my derpy chew that they sent me as a little freebie and I love him. 
<laughs> I think I might actually like him more than the polka doll that they sent me because he's just so fat and his face is kind of derpy and I love him. I love the brown on his ears. I don't care that he's a bootleg. He's, he's pretty fantastic. He's pretty great. So yeah, there's him. So I'm going to set him down. And so this is what they actually sent me. They sent me the Japanese Pikachu polka doll and then they sent me... The Raichu polka doll and you know, you know, whoop, whoops, dropping everything. I, I have Pikachu, but it's from, you know, the U.S. Pokemon Center. And I think this is, this is a 2016 polka doll. And then this is a 2012 Raichu. I didn't think I'd ever own him because I think he went up pretty substantially in price. So I was pretty happy to get him uh, from a trade and he's he's really cute. He's really chunky as if you couldn't tell I really love chunky Pokemon items. I think they're adorable So yeah, I'm so happy to add them and be able to send out giant Dialgas to you So this was the thing that was sitting on my gaming shelf that I I'm like really excited to have because I got it for a Pretty good price all things considered because I I hosted a group order on the discord and I got a lovely mint in box. Well, not mint, but I mean, new in box, Game Boy Advance SP, the Pikachu version. And um, I still have yet to get the Legend of Zelda one with its box. I have two Legend of Zelda ones, but without their box. So it was really happy to get this. Apparently this thing on its own is like $200. And I got the lot for something cheaper than that. But I mean, shipping pff, killed me, but um, if, you know, I made up back the money from selling a whole bunch of stickers from the lot and I was really happy about that. So yeah, I got this for a really good price and I'm really excited about that. So nice collection. Nice to add to my collection. Um, oh yeah. And it cherish, cherish you sent me a whole bunch of extra cards with the trade. Um, so that was really nice. Um, I don't want to share that one yet. So I'll pull this guy out. Uh, the Flareon Power Bouncer, I'm sure all of you had these, and everybody, I'm of course, ugh, excuse me, freed theirs from their, their case. I actually have him still in his Power Bouncer. He's actually up on my shelf somewhere, but he's, it's really badly yellowed, and it's like sticky and gross. So he was really cheap on eBay, nice little eBay find, so I figured, well, why not get one nice in package? So that was nice. Um, let's see what else? Okay, so I'll share this one next. I'm kind of nervous about pulling this one out with my claws, so I gotta be careful with this one because I don't want to bend it. Right. So this, someone showed me on the Discord, and I'm so happy they did. It's so pristine, and it's so pretty. I, I love stuff like this, like older Entei stuff, especially stuff that relates to the movie, and it's, it's basically just the movie. It's not, it's called an art book, but you know, it has like scenes from the music movie and everything. And on the back, it just has like the Pichu Bros short, but it's in such great condition. I'm like so happy. It's called the art of the Pokemon, the movie three spell of the unknown. And, oh, I'm, I'm really excited about this. Like just to have this, like, I know it's silly. There's a whole bunch of them on eBay, but it's so pristine, like Think about how old this movie is, and someone kept this in, like, such nice, pristine condition. Someone probably bought this for their kid, and it's like, this is the condition I got. Like, it's just amazing. And, um, if, for those who don't know, I do collect Legend of Zelda, and one of the things I do collect is, uh, guidebooks for the Zelda games. And when they come mint like this, like, pristine, and I don't expect it, it's like, ah, so exciting. I love looking through these types of books. It actually still smells like a brand new book. I, I did sniff my book and on the back here I can see that it originally costed like $13 to buy which is you know more expensive than what I bought it for which is pretty awesome so yeah that's the back and everything so yeah that, that was a really exciting find so I'm only going to show him off next because uh underneath is some package stuff that I can't get out around him but this was a really awesome eBay find, and I have Snagglebun to thank for this, so thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, because not only is it in, like, awesome, awesome condition, but I was, like, haggling with someone who, 
I think you know the story about it, but they were like, oh no, this is worth at least 200 and offering 75 is way too low. Like, you know, this is worth way more money. And I was like, no, it's, it's not. And I was showing them like, you know, what it actually was worth. And they were telling me no. And then this pops up on eBay for $30. $30 and it's like in pristine condition and I don't even care that it doesn't have its little zappy things because I have a regular one that has all four zappy things and then I have one mint in package so I could just give the zappy things to this one but this special guy so excited the shiny version of the Hasbro action figure of Zapdos so now I'm only missing like a few of them now I think I'm just missing like Chikorita uh I've got a few others that are coming that I just haven't, you know, we haven't, I haven't spoke to the person yet, but I have Blastoise and Spinarak from someone else, so I think it's just like Chikorita and Scyther now that I'm missing, so this is really, really exciting to have this guy, and ah, he's in such good condition, like normally they come, like the one I was like offering 75 on was all scratched up, he didn't look like, you know, he had Cyndaquil shooters sticking out of him, and it's like he's so perfect, I'm so happy, and he's so pretty. I love the color of his feet and his legs. Like, I'll have to take comparison shots for Instagram or something of, like, the, the two together. Because he's kind of like a golden, orangish color instead of his yellow. He's just, ah, oh, he's so pretty. I'm so happy to have him. I'm so happy to find him for such a good deal. Well, I didn't find him. My, my really, really good friend did. And thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. So, yeah, there's that guy. So that's kind of my most exciting get, and I was hoping I could save him for last. But these, I, uh, a seller popped up. I think there's been some guy selling a whole bunch of these, and they've all been like $80, and it's ridiculous. But I contacted a seller, and I was like, a different seller, and I was like, hey, would you be willing to sell these as a set and discount the price and maybe throw in some shipping? And they were like, yeah, that sounds doable, so why don't you just offer it, you know, offer this much on them and I'll accept your offer and we'll go from there and so they did so I managed to get all three so I got um as you can tell there's kind of been a uh system to my madness if you haven't seen my collection post recently but I got the mint in package Hasbro Blastoise his little action is that he squirts water and I thought you know oh I would like to hang them up sometime with my Articuno Zapdos Maltras Intermittent Package. And then next I have my Venusaur in the package. His package is a little bent on the side, but not terribly so. And then last but not least, well, I was happy to find for a really, really, really cheap price, considering I think the last one sold for a lot of money, and I paid like a fraction of it, is Charizard in his package. And, uh, yeah, I'm, uh, it's like, I've been, I've been eyeing up a Blastoise on eBay for a while, and it was actually cheaper to get him in the package than it was to get him out of the package, just the way, you know, ordering them from the set. So, yeah, those are all my gets. Nor my feet. Don't look at my feet. <laughs> but, yeah, this is everything. And, uh, thanks for joining me. Oh, I'm so happy. I'm so happy. One more time, my little my shiny Zapdos boy. I'm so happy. So that's everything for me today. And uh, thank you everybody who's been watching these videos. I've gotten a lot of positive feedback about it. And uh, thank you. Just like, I can't, I really can't thank you enough. Like all, all the nice positive comments, they, they really mean a lot to me. So I'll go ahead and get this one posted up so that way all of you can watch it. I, I know some of you play it while you're doing art and stuff and that's, that's awesome. That's amazing. That makes me feel so good. So uh, until next time, uh, bye guys.